Monica Mitro, Vice President of Public Relations for Victoria's Secret, spices up the annual swimwear catalog by hiring the modeling world's hottest new prospects. This year we tried two new models, Adriana and Fernanda. Now Adriana we used in our uh, cotton commercial, which we really liked her, and we thought that uh, she would be great in the swim book. President of Intimate Brands Ed Razik cast the two Brazilian beauties because of each woman's distinct look. Adriana did our fashion show last February, and um, the look she gave the camera the first time she walked down the runway is, was just so fantastic. And she said that for her, it was, um, it was her first day as a woman. And that, that kind of established her. Uh, and this year, she's doing all of the fashion shows. She's just gotten to be a very hot model in a very short amount of time. I think the dream of a lot of girls to be Victoria's Secret, and when they calling me to say that I, I'm going to work with them, I say, oh my God, I just can't believe it. I just can't believe it. Actually, I never think before to be a model. And, and then um, when I was young, I used to be really scared of photo cameras. When I grow up, my friends, they're like, oh, you're so thin and you're beautiful, you're tall. Why don't you be a model? And I said, okay, so I started. And I met a friend that he knew was somebody from my agency, and they introduced me, and I started to be a model. A string of high-profile jobs soon followed, including the spring 1999 BB campaign. I worked for Vogue magazine. Italian Vogue with Steve Mezel and uh, Peter Lindbergh. And now I'm doing Victoria's Secret. I used to, to go always to do the casting, but they never, you know, asked it for me. And I went last year to try to do his show, the website show. And then from there they met me and they saw me, okay, and then they asked me to do the show. And after that, I, I kept going, going, doing, I mean, doing the pictures and everything now. Fernanda, uh, who's also coming in this weekend, who we've been trying very hard to get for a long time, is a spectacular, statuesque, brunette model, uh, very strong girl, fabulous body, strong into the camera, a lot of power, great power with her eyes. Hailing from a small town northeast of Brazil, Fernanda Tavares began her modeling career at 14. Soon thereafter, she was sent to Milan for the annual spring fashion show. When she landed the esteemed cover of Cosmopolitan's 1999 swimsuit issue, she became one of modeling's most sought-after faces. At the beginning, it's really, it's really difficult, you know. It's, it takes a little while to get glamorous. <laughs> but after, once it gets glamorous, so it's, it goes forever, I think. It's really good. I met her like one year ago when she first started in New York. Uh, we worked together and she didn't speak any English, me either. And we was trying to talk with one girl, an American girl, and he ha we had a dictionary in us hand. Remember when they had a book, when they was working together and we had a, oh, the yeah. dictionary? I know, I still have it <laughs> in my bag. <laughs> but now I have two, I have English and I have French. You know, I have the, both dictionaries. She's beautiful. I love her skin color. And she's really simple. She has a good heart inside. She's amazing. I know Adriana since, um, we know each other from Brazil, actually. And then now we're working together, so it's like, it's good. What I want you? her to teach me how to samba. Oh. <laughs> Come on. You start with the right? right. Okay, Come let's do it now. Go. You start to do this and then <laughs> just change you. <laughs> it's good to have somebody who works in the same area with the same age. Because I can see that I'm not the only one who is nervous. And it's funny because, you know, we talk the same things because we are teenagers. Jonathan Dagg, or John Dagg and I'm just friends with Adriana. I'm a hairstylist, and I've worked with Adriana in the past for shows and for photo shoots and whatnot, but we've become really good friends. Adriana's doing really well with the pressures, I believe, just because she's one of the new faces, and you're working with people who have been around in the industry a little bit longer, but fortunately, they've been really helpful. They make me feel really good, because I'm a I'm new one, you know, and sometimes the people doesn't treat the new girls right, and I'm working with the big models, you know, and they treat me in the same way. 
they treat me like I start like them. Everybody that they say about oh, Victoria's Secret is like, oh, whoa, wow, that's really good to be Victoria's Secret's mom. So I feel like um, <laughs> really important. Ah. <laughs> ah, but it's really good, it's really excited. Victoria's Secret makes me feel sexy, but not in the bad way, in the good way, with innocence, like a good, sexy, not a rude way and then it's a beautiful sexy it makes you feel like sexy and beautiful you know i'm just highlighting giving some shimmer on your body thank you skin looks all glowy just making her look sexy and warm she has incredible eyes and you know, a great body and it's kind of beautiful, shiny, straight hair. And she has such a, a great young spirit. And when we do this one book, we really look for women that not only are beautiful and sexy, but they have great personalities because they're they're in swimwear, they're running around. We want to project to our uh, clients that the suits are you know sexy and they're usable. I think it's the dream of the, all the girls to do Victoria's Secret. I know. You know, because they they have a really beautiful, sexy image. And then... And they chose the right girl, right? Cause no, she's, like... she's the right one. She, look at this girl. Look at her face. She's so beautiful. Look at her skin color. Oh, look. She's, so, she's amazing. I love her. <laughs> it's very exciting for them because they know that uh, millions of catalogs are mailed, that there's going to be a lot of publicity around the book. And once people hear and see that they were in Victoria's Secret, it really is going to advance their careers.